in this video, I'm going to be showing you guys something that I should have shown you guys a long time ago. And that is, how do you AFK or auto-click on an iOS device? Now, this is pretty difficult because there are no apps for this on the App Store. Basically, all of them are literally just Bruh. websites where you can auto-click on. But this time, I have a way to actually do this the right way. And that is to do it a different way. So, right before we get into the method, Eon 1 is extremely close. This time, it's closer than ever. Hasn't ever been closer, guys. There is only a couple of NPC dialogues, a merchant, a stellar star quest, a small visual bug fix, and some critical bug in NPCs, and three red squares, one in system and two in test. And then, Eon 1 will be ready. It should come out this Friday, because that's when devs are off school for the weekend which basically means that we're getting eon 1 extremely soon and finally right before we get to this of course i'm gonna have to ask you guys to please subscribe as we are getting closer and closer to 10k by the day so now let's get into this thing so what do you need for this first of all you're going to want to get your hands on one of these now for example this one this is a manual auto clicker it's pretty cheap you can even get them for less than a euro if they are on sale as a first time bonus and what these basically do is that they let you auto click without using an app you just plug it into the wall you put it on your phone or tablet and then it just starts clicking for you that's basically the only thing you'll need they're pretty cheap you could of course get these on amazon as well just for a little more expensive but the delivery is usually faster as a, in aliexpress it's like two weeks it sometimes can take a while for them to arrive so those are the requirements so let's go to the next step now this is where i'm gonna have to load in on my decade old 10 year old ipad yeah this will not be very pleasant but doesn't matter and now we are in on my ipad yeah this isn't very high quality, but it doesn't matter for the purpose of the video. So right before you want to start doing the auto clicker stuff, you want to know where your roll button, your skip, and your auto reconnect is. And that is because we are going to click on the button in the next few steps. So first of all, you want to get a piece of tape or something you can stick on with not too much glue because that would just do that would just be bad. Please don't do that. And this might be a crime to some, but for the purpose of the video, it isn't. Welcome to the hand reveal guys, anyway let's just put this piece of tape right beside the roll button, make sure you remember that it's there, and then the next step is that you're going to want to go into your settings, enable the skip warning, press apply, and go to your aura filter and just disable something like rare, and disable your auto equip as well. I just recommend to disable everything. And now after you're in here, you can now see where your skip button is. You just want to put a piece of tape beside that as well. Yes, I want to skip this aura. Let's disable the auto roll before I fill up my inventory full of rares, which would just suck. And after you've done that, you're of course going to want to remember to just turn everything on. And now that's basically all. You probably want to just remember to forget about rares again. Now the final step is locating where your reconnect button is. So the next step is just disable your internet. And you should see this. You just put a piece of tape beside that. And now turn on your Wi-Fi again. Wait a little bit. It'll probably be a bit slow on here to be honest. Here's when the next step comes in. You want to be in your settings app. Now once you're in your settings app. You want to simply scroll down, find the little jumping jack guy besides accessibility, go into that, and go into switch control, which looks like the Windows 11 logo, the cheeky of Apple there. And next step is go into recipes. So what you next want to do is go create a new recipe and create any name, just something like Soul RNG. Now, after you've created a name, you simply want to assign a switch, full screen, and create a custom gesture. Now this is where the tape comes in guys. So basically what I would just do is just press hide controls and just click for about 10 seconds. Just keep on clicking, click as often as you can so you don't well create an issue and just press stop as soon as you can. Now press save, so just press timeout and I'd recommend going to 10 seconds so that if you disable your auto clicker after 10 seconds it should just turn off. But it can take a while to turn off, I'd recommend just powering on and off again. So now exit the recipes, you have now created yourself a recipe. I don't know why it autocorrects, I actually hate Apple autocorrect guys, but this is your recipe. You can now exit recipes and go into switches. Next, go into full screen, 
remember to select the accessibility shortcut right down here exit and that's the first step done the final thing you need to do is exit switch control go down to general and find your accessibility shortcut and you want to press on switch control so what this does is that every single time you triple click your home button it will enable the switch which would mean that every single time you press on the screen it will click in those three places so now this is the next step this is where it starts getting good now this is the auto clicker that you're going to want to use plugged in so it's on by pressing the power button over here it depends on what auto clicker you have but i'd recommend setting the click to one because you don't really need to click really fast with this because the switch should last 10 seconds so now the next step is to simply go into any game i just go into souls rng because that's what this is about go into servers join your server and now you're in the next step is to go basically anywhere on the map if you want you can be right beside a potion spot clip on the auto clicker to the side of the device and now once you're done that you finally just want to triple click on your home button right like this it might be different if you're using an iphone without a home button and just press play and what this does is just click on your screen it's very lagging on my ipad here but basically what this does is just click forever every single time this flashes over here that's when it clicks and yeah this is basically all you can leave this on overnight please if you want to have this not run out of battery plug your ipad in as well and then you should just be rolling forever and now to stop it you just press pause should be off and all that you really gotta do now is just triple click the home button and then you could do whatever you want here but as well as that i'd also recommend doing stuff like disabling your auto rotate and disabling your screen timeout if you have any on in your settings in display what that could do is potentially close your screen while you're clicking which could break everything so that was the entire tutorial guys that's how you auto click on ios sad that there isn't an app for it but this is a very good way of doing this kind of thing i've tested it overnight it worked pretty well and it basically did what i was able to do with the android auto clicker just that it needed an extra device so please like and subscribe if you guys want me to update this free on one because they might be adding an auto reconnect feature which will require less points and well goodbye